Hello, my name is Megan Seven. I'm a final year student in DCU. I'm studying science education and my subjects are physics and maths. This year I took part in the STEM internship programme and I was placed in Ericsson's in Athlone. I was lucky enough to be part of the Infuse team in Ericsson's. So Infuse stands for Investing in Future Software Engineers. Um, and the purpose of this program is to inspire students who want to be software engineers in the future. So the Infuse team um, organised camps and TY weeks throughout the school year uh, to teach students about what it's like to be a software engineer. So as part of this team, I um, created new PowerPoint presentations and updated ones from previous years so that they could work um, in a virtual environment. Um, so the Infuse team has, hold, has held sorry, these camps for numerous years, but it had to be changed a lot because of the climate we're in at the moment. Um, so that was kind of our main task to help, um, help to make the camps more engaging and interactive virtually. Um, I also got to learn a lot of different languages of code while I was with them. So I got to learn HTML and CSS and um, Python. And I also got to learn coding um, using Scratch software. Um, so I had learned HTML and CSS coding from the very beginning. I'd never done it before. Um, I'd never created a website or anything. But um, throughout the internship, I got so much better at it that I was able to mentor in one of the camps. That was a really, really good experience. Um, I also think that my communication skills have improved so much since I've started with Ericsson's. Um, when I started, like when I began the internship, I was so nervous to ask any questions. Um, I wasn't really good at like writing emails either. But yeah, my skills in that regard developed so much. Um, I know now that it's totally okay to ask questions. And I feel like that's something that I can bring um, or that I can use when I start teaching in a school. I wouldn't be nervous at all to ask questions because I suppose that's the only way you're going to learn. Um, I also think that stand-ups are a really good idea and they could be really useful to bring to a classroom. So in Ericsson's, um, we started every day with a stand-up meeting. So um, we would discuss what we had done the previous day and what we were planning to do today. So I think that might be something that we could bring, um, or I could bring, sorry, into the classroom. Um, I suppose we could just um, discuss basically what we'd learned the last day and what we were planning to learn today. And I feel like it might really help the students focus. Um, I also think it might be good to um, bring the code that I have learned from my internship into a school. Um, I suppose I've learned so much from doing the internship that it definitely would be a waste not to use it. Um, so yeah, I suppose there are a couple of things that I think have really I've really benefited from. Um, and I also think that if anyone was considering doing this internship, I would highly recommend it. Um, I've learned so much. Obviously, I was so nervous starting, but I think it was a really, really good experience overall.